you. I've heard that uh, in terms of global warming, that water vapor is the major contributor. And with carbon dioxide representing 400 parts per million of the air, it's actually a minor contributor. And it's actually good for plants if it were to increase. Uh, any truth? Well, it, it's, it's certainly true that more carbon dioxide in the atmosphere um, increases plant growth. It's also the case that the most ubiquitous and strongest uh, greenhouse gas is, as you say, water vapour. And my understanding of the science is that the IPCC's, uh, the consensus um, view or predictions of, of, of warming depend on in more CO2 causing more water vapour. So it's the amplification effect of, of CO2, uh, of CO2 on, on water vapour that the, the, is critical to the values they get for, for, for global warming. But this all has to be proved, and the only proof is in observations, matching your predictions against observations. And every year that passes, the gap between prediction and observation has widened. And that, you know, if, they'd been, if they were true scientists, they'd be asking ourselves, well, actually, we have to revise our, we have to revise, you know, perhaps there isn't so much of an ampli amplification effect. But that is a matter for sci scientists to work out, not to justify their predictions, but to change, to accept that they need to change their understanding of what's going on in the Earth's atmosphere. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs>